Yeah, man, y'all already know what it is, man. About to get into this Cat Williams again, man. I just wanted to show y'all a little clip. You know, on here he talking about the Chris Tucker stuff, so I just wanted to show y'all you know, a little is bit. Epstein Island, Chris Tucker. Oh, if y'all didn't check smoking. it out, man, y'all go check oh, it out. Lord. Check out the full, you know, interview, man. Woo! <laughs> and I didn't know no better, I tell you. He's the greatest. I don't care what you say. <laughs> <laughs> my bad, man. That was funny. To be man. confident funny and not bad. delusional. I was is speaking his mind, man. Most of these confident people we see is really delusional. Well, you don't think you don't think they asked Chris Tucker to come back in the second in the snip in the second Friday? Smokey, Smokey was all in. Smokey, there ain't no Friday without Smokey. <laughs> we all agree to that, and there's no next Friday without Friday, yeah, and there's no Friday after Friday. next without. Nah, Friday. we talk about the rule because you said that they don't. Here's the thing. Okay. Here's the thing. Chris was allowed to make the decision at the time that this is happening. Cat Williams is known for smoking weed. Willie Nelson is known for smoking weed. Right. Snoop's known for smoking weed. But none of us is really known except Willie. And I'm saying, Chris Tucker didn't want to be the poster child for smoking weed. He don't right. smoke weed like, like that. that. Right. He in the church. He Michael Jackson's best friend. Christmas. <laughs> Michael Jackson called him Christmas. Christmas. You ever met a man that gave you a little nickname like that? No. Mm -mm, me neither. This nigga said Christmas. Oh, shit. <laughs> now, hey, y'all, if y'all remember back in the day, man, Chris Tucker was very close with Michael Jackson. And, hey, Michael Jackson, you know, <laughs> he was living that life, y'all. So, you know, but it was good to see him. I would wish he would have came back for another, um, Another um movie, another Friday, but you know he got on his holy shit at the time. Man, I ain't gonna be able to get nobody back. I ain't gonna be able to get no more comedians. They all coming. No, they ain't. Are you kidding? Nah. Hey, I, I promise you, I got all the I, rest of them. I done got, I done got the ones. Every, I promise you, everybody trying to double back. You gonna be having to beat them all with a stick. <laughs> <laughs> you gonna let him? Okay. <laughs> Much as nah, they gonna come talking shit, man. <laughs> <laughs> hey, uh, my goal, yeah, man. But like I was saying, man, I wish he would have came back. But at the time, he, you know, got on his little church stuff and you know, you know, say, supposedly saved his life and all that. So you already know what that was. But you know, at the time, too, he played that movie on. Um, Fifth Element and stuff, and he was doing some, you know, weird shit in there and all that, too. So, anybody know about that movie, go check that out. But he tried to, you know, change his life up. It's a little, you know, a little history for y'all, you know. But not to keep going in and on all that. But, yeah, man, I wanted y'all just to see a little bit of the interview and stuff, man. But, yeah, man, y'all hit that like button. Y'all hit the subscribe button. Shout out to them iPhones, man. Y'all already know, man. Y'all stay safe, man. Oh, oh.